Pocket Tracer 7 offers a really good option that you need to master if you want to take a Cisco exam and of course it is extremely important to know SPAN if you have to troubleshoot something in the real world and now you can play with SPAN using Packet Tracer. Here I want to show you what SPAN is and of course we will try and enable this feature using Packet Tracer. To make sure we're on the same page, SPAN allows you to monitor and capture network traffic in a way we can say that you can make your switch work as a hub. What does it mean? Well, please check we have PC1 and PC2. Then we have one monitoring device. It means that PC1 is connected to F01. This is our source port. And PC2 is connected to F02, a source port as well. Now F024 is our destination span port. PC1 is sending a message to PC2. And then a copy of this message arrives at our monitoring device. That's it. This is what you can achieve when you enable span on a Cisco device. So now let's go and connect to Packet Tracer and enable this feature. I want to create uh, a very similar topology with one switch, two PCs, and I want to capture ICMP. Do you remember ICMP? It's like ping is the best example. Ping uses ICMP, and when I ping PC1 from PC2, of course this message should never ever ever arrive at F024. However, when we enable span, even though PC1 is pinging PC2, a copy of this message will be sent to our monitoring device. Here we go, I am connected, we'll need one switch, two PCs and one monitoring device. Let's connect all devices now. I will use a static IP address on PC0 and PC1. Do you remember F01 and F02 are our sources and F024 is our destination. So let's go to the global configuration mode and we type monitor session, whatever number you want. I will say I want to configure I want to configure session number 1 and then Okay, two options, source and destination. Well, I want to say source is interface F01 and F02. I'll show you something, you can be more specific and tell, oh, I want to have incoming and outgoing traffic as well, or both. Here I want to keep it really simple so let's leave the default option now the second thing is destination what is our destination f024 believe it or not but this is all you have to do to enable span to verify use the show monitor command to verify this configuration are you ready to test it Let's open this guy. 
you can see a lot of messages over here. Please note you can edit and specify what you want to see. I will keep it, that's fine. But I want to see an ICMP message. Do you remember? Ping. PC0 is going to ping PC1. And this ICMP message, message should never ever go to F024. However, we have just enabled span. It means that a copy of this message will be sent to our monitoring device. Let's check it out. Let's scroll down, here we go. ICMP, source destination. How cool is this? I recommend you play with Span and now it is extremely easy because you can use Packet Tracer 7.